Welcome back to the channel guys. Today I've gone and crafted myself 50 82 plus player picks. A couple weeks out from the new game and I just need some fodder to try and complete that Ronaldo. EA are finally, finally, finally giving us some high rated players in the SPCs. So I got all my low rated players and I've gone and crafted 50 player picks to try to get some high rated fodder to help me complete more SPCs and hopefully do one or two more runs in foot champs and so far these have been decent I mean, we've got 97 to show for already another 97 Chevchenko. i need the high red fodder here hopefully a couple 99s as well wouldn't go wouldn't be too bad i guess i would take those for sure hopefully a sun or a lucio those are the guys in packs right now gonna do the method where i do one skip one and guys, as always, make sure you go and craft 10 of these yourself and then let me know what you get from them. We got another Benasir here, which is great, 91 plus. It's going to help do some kind of SPC, that's for sure. And the weird part is, is that we're about like 15 days or so. Ooh, nice. Nope, take the lithium in there. We're about 15 days or so from starting everything from scratch and we're going to be going back to doing these player picks and expecting like an 87 Berkey to be a dub or some kind of low rated uh, meta player like an 86 Dan Billy in September always goes crazy because you know you got yourself a really meta player and it's like the two complete extremes and again I 89 Alice in there and as always when the new game comes out it's gonna feel slow that's only because we're gonna be going from playing with 99 rated players with 99 rated stats across the board to regular gold players with lesser stats and automatically that's gonna make the game feel slower and about December, January, we're going to go back to, oh, this game's all about pace. This game's all about that. So, guys, enjoy the beginning of the game. To me, the beginning of a new cycle is always the most fun. Uh, you make the most upgrades to your team. You can kind of use a little bit lesser team and get away with it. And, of course, you're going to go with the champs. You're going to have that one kid with 90 rid of Bellingham and the... Uh, the 91 Mbappe, but then you get to beat him with your like your 83 rated uh, striker who has like 90 pace. So it's fun. The best time of the game cycle for me. Comment down below what you think the best game cycle is or the best part of the game cycle. That's another Coleman, like back to back picks almost. And these have been decent for fodder, but I was expecting a little bit more. I mean, only two 97 rated cards out of these so far. And a couple 89s, a couple 91 Ben Asers. Come on out. Ooh, that's a little Jimenez action. Have him in the club, of course. Kind of hard not to have any of these cards at this point. Now, come on. <laughs> now, Yuli. I'm also at the point now that like 88s and stuff like that. Like, I almost want to take the 83 if I have him in my club. Just so I don't have to deal with the headache of having to put that card somewhere. But since we're doing this for fodder, we'll keep looking for the highest rated ones. Come on, yay. Bless me here. Bless me here. It takes me. It took me like an hour almost to craft these. And I'm getting through these so fast, hoping for something major. Let's go back to the beginning. Let's go back to the beginning here. Maybe that's part of the issue. Come on. Back at the beginning. I'll have the 84. It doesn't really matter. That Gretzka card is pretty crazy, but he's cheap. He's probably 30k in this market. Barely any players hold any value right now. 95 hemp. That's what we need right there. More of that game. Come on. Ah, uh, Jesus. That card was tough to pack when he was in promo. Come on now. Come on now. Mm. Almost feels disappointing when you open a pick. And you don't get a special card in there nowadays. It's like, come on. What am I doing wrong, you know? We're going to go steadily through these and hope for one more big pull. 297s. I'm happy. 95 is great as well. We'll take a Mancini there. Why not? Come on, E8. Okay, an 89 Kanate. That card was a beast when he first dropped as well. I forget how many coins he was, but he was basically extinct. And we got 28 duplicates. We got an 85 Jota here. He was a great starter card at the beginning of this FIFA. Ooh, Kohler in there. Another 90 rated. Come on. We're almost through these. And I feel like they've slowed down like crazy. They have definitely slowed down like crazy here. Come on. Ooh, 97 Vieira. That is nice. How much does he go for? Okay, doesn't go for that much, but still, that's a sick pull to get. 97 Vieira. We will not say no to that. Come on now. Have you guys also been completing the objectives for the FC25? Getting you prepared for the game. Last one here. Come on, EA. 
Come on now. We're going to get an 87 Pacho, who now plays for PSG. But a Vieira, a Goretzka, Hamp, and some more high rated cards. I would say that's successful for the amount of value I put into these. As always, craft yourself 10 of these. Comment down below what you got from them. If you enjoyed the video, leave it a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll catch you guys all on the next one.